but from very much on the radar, so he knew they'd had to get out in 1938 when the Anschluss happened. First, the Nazis marched in and took over Austria. They left. They did go over the mountain, but they went to the local train station, got on the train and went to Italy before making their way up to the UK and then got on a ship to America. That got them out. They did tour for a time until their visa ran out while they sorted their paperwork they were in Scandinavia. They went back, of course, the war had broken out at this time, and they decided to stay in America. They built their land in Stowe, Vermont, because it reminded them the most of Austria with the landscape there. They had, a, they lived there for the rest of their lives um, with the, the lodge that they built. They took it for many decades as well. The captain passed away in 1947, Maria wrote the book in 1949, and then she went and continued her work of God, being a missionary down in Papua New Guinea. So that's where she was when she was approached to sell the rights of her book to write the musical, which led to the movie, which 59 years later brought you here today. That's the Bob Tribe story in a nutshell. But we are now heading up out of the city and into the hills. But a very 